What's up everybody, Jeremy Clay Cash, live feed and video. If you can't stand to see the chick die, you need to quit watching this video now. I, I can't warn you enough that the chick's not gonna survive the video. It's being fed to a snake. I got a Crotalus derisus down here, a very, very neurotoxic neotropical rattlesnake. And when I put this in the tank, I don't think it's gonna take very long and it's gonna get hit. So the chick's not gonna survive the video. Please do not watch the video further if you cannot take that happening. Here we go. If that was Slash or any of my crew, this would already be over and done with. I don't know if this snake's ever had a chick as prey. So let's just wait and see what kind of happens here. Okay, well, now we know what's going to happen. All right, so they bite us. They bite and they hold on. It's a neurotoxin. As it starts to take effect, things will happen rather quickly. Very crazy that rattlesnakes hold on. This is the second different species I've seen bite a chick and then not let go. I think that's just insane. Okay, so evidently it didn't, well. I find that so crazy that these things are supposed to be so neurotoxic and so hot. And then it takes it probably a full minute longer, maybe maybe considerably longer than that for it to dispatch the prey as quickly as one of the cane breaks would. Very interesting. But this might be this animal's first time ever having a chick. So Maybe it gave it a small, very, very small do dose. Very interesting. Very interesting. I think that's it. No, I still see a little movement out of the chick. And this guy's not completely neurotoxic. I'm seeing some, I believe some ev evidence of some hemorrhagic effects around the bite wound. So, this might be one of the most dangerous varieties of the Dorisus. If it has that hemorrhagic additive to its venom, that could make this animal a lot scarier animal. And even though it's taken this chick considerably longer to die than what I would have expected, this is still probably the last rattlesnake, definitely in my collection, that I'd want to get hit by. These guys have absolutely terrifying venom. It takes, I believe, 18 milligrams to kill an adult human being. Uh, someone around 60 kilos be like 230, 240 pounds or whatever 60 times 2.2 is. 
and they generally inject around 150 milligrams. So we're talking five, six times, six times plus the actual dosage it would take to uh, kill a human being. I would reach in there with something else and dispatch the chick, but I don't want to take a chance and making this animal nervous about eating. So we're just going to have to wait this out. Sorry for the shaking guys. It's been a long day. I drove 11 hours today and got home and started a live feeding video. <laughs> I know there's been a lot of talk about please stay on and video each animal longer, which is hard to do when you have so many animals. I hope you guys understand that part of this, but I am trying to appease what y'all are asking for and give y'all as much of the time as I can. But when you're feeding 30 animals, it's kind of a get it, get it over, get it done with and move on to the next kind of thing a lot of times, guys. Yeah, I find it hard to believe that the crow toxin is as dangerous as cambrake toxin for, for birds. <laughs> Cause we're gonna put one in here with Slash or somebody in a minute. We're gonna see a much, much more rapid result. But as you can see, you do not want to get bit by one of these neotropicals. They don't let go. So it's not a minute envenomation or a chance of a dry bite. If you get hit like this, you're getting a significant amount of venom. And with this particular species of rattlesnake, it's, a, it's enough to kill you. It's enough to kill you and several of your friends <laughs> in one dose. So this is not an animal to be taken lightly. It's a shaky video guys, cause I have to video every one of these with my cell phone. So I feed with one hand and then I'm videoing with the other. I don't have a really good way to record these videos yet. We'll see how things take off on the second run. If things get real, real popular again, we will uh, look into getting, we'll look into get some new cameras and some better ways of getting more quality video for the channel. Y'all hear a chick in the background? That's not the chick in the tank. The chick in the tank is now down to nervous reaction and very, very small, slow nervous reaction. I think we're about done as far as 
there being any real well, real life left in the animal. And that did take longer than what I expected, considerably longer than what I expected. Still having some nervous reaction. All right, guys, this snake's traveled all day and it does look like it's going to feed. So I'm going to stop the recording. We're down to nothing but nervous reaction. Very, very light, light nervous reaction. The neurotoxin has really took effect. So now we can close this off and uh, I'm gonna put a sheet over this guy and let him consume his prey. Crotalus dorissus, the neotropical or South American rattlesnake.